places everyone. Gold Log Films is around the corner. Does that mean we're still doing season one? I'm afraid so. But hey, we got the logo requests back. Wait, we do? Holy shit. Wow, it's been a long ass time. I agree with you, Amos. I hate to say it, but I miss those logo requests. I agree with you on that. Natural Mary. Roll camera. Sounds on. Sounds on. Quit it before it hits something. Hitting up a fence. Cue the spinning vortex G. <laughs> We see a landscape of a rocky shore in front of the sea at night. With the full moon illuminating this air. At the left side of the shore. We see a lighthouse and its light is rotating. Then, the full moon throws a yellow beam which forms this text. Peninsula Productions. The lighthouse, the beam of the moon, the water and the text. Seen on Tamil language film Martha Mua Hasego. <laughs> All the animation, which is good for a Cambodian logo, although it is pretty in your face somehow. As the logo takes the most part of the screen at the end, the wooden floor appearing is also very sudden and the Cambodian territory appearing behind the logo makes it uglier looking. The dramatic movie-like soundtrack at first, jarringly interrupted by a crawling sound and then a mechanical closing sound to medium. Due to the dramatics and imposing logo design. This is 2021, not 2005, and it's not camera production either. Sorry, sometimes I always mess up. It's okay, Alexis. It's not your fault. And besides, we all love these bloopers. <laughs> Studio Ghibli. Only yesterday, 1991. Princess Mononoke, 1997. Spirited Away, 2001. Ponyo, 2008. The Secret World of Eddie Eddie, 2010. From Up on Poppy Hill, 2011. Whatever. <laughs> Through a television. Does TVA stand for the best apple? <laughs> Martha, be careful with that fourth wall. It's already broken. Sorry, babe, I'm Mitchell. Looks like Beulah and Alexis are going at it again. What did I fucking tell your hippo ass about the fucking redress, you fucking fat whore? Give me the sexy ass skinny vortex key or I'll send dark flow after you. I'll show you, fat ass. Here we go again. <laughs> You asshole, you will not the Dark Fall Productions logo. Ha, scare you, goodbye, Harry. Ha 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 ha. Nice going, fat ass. This is why Scotty divorced you in the first place. Well, I hope you're happy, dumbass. No wonder why no one likes you. Did I tell you about Beulah misbehaving? Did he tell you that Miss Madsen invited Sip Sean and Girl Jordan in her studio? <laughs> Gasp. I'm so sorry, Calvin. I didn't mean to. Oh my god, Calvin, Julia Nightingale. Call the hospital, now. Get it, faggots. No pains, no soul. Start with that ass, start with that ass. Tell me why did Bill Vyka apologize to Calvin and Cody three weeks ago? Because Calvin was suffering from Nickelodeon in one month ago. Okay, now let's go dance. Jesus Christ, you knocked our sister out. You bastard. Good job. 
fat ass? She was asking for it. Looked like you guys come in the right time. Not so fucking fast. Nickelodeon and Victrudes told me that they don't pay the price. Their asses are ours. Fuck you, dark fool. You don't need their souls. Yeah, so go fuck yourself. You heard her, tree ass. You know what's going to any line? What a bet! Yes, I'm coming, bitch! Viva film, back it! I got you, ace from heaven. Alright, dark fool, you asked for it. <laughs> Thank God. You're welcome. Looks like Lucy's getting up. Oh. What happened? Lucy, you're okay. I'm glad that you're alright. And I think Kelvin's passing out. Don't worry, Jack. I promise you he'll make it. Well, at least Alexis is getting the hang of it. I agree. Lily. I feel kinda tired myself, so what's gonna happen to Sydney? I don't know, but she might be fired. Or might be sent to bed without supper. Or might be suspended for five days. I hope Kelvin recovers from his spaz attacks. I hope so too. I always took care of him and I wasn't even cheating on my boyfriend. Don't worry you guys, I can call Tyler and tell him to replace Kelvin until he gets out of his spazzing sides. Tell him that I'm sorry for making him freak out. I'll make sure he hears it, Julia. It's not your fault. Well, let's all take a rest just for one day. Good idea. After that, we can go see how your best friend's doing. I hope he's not to shanken up. I'm with you on that, Sonata. How am I ruining our friendship?